This is not a poem, and I am not a poet. As fair eyes rest upon an innocence is disguised, I retire and look up at the sky. Rapunzel, Rapunzel! Girls at the top of ivory tower blocks. Her beauty was ugly. Her collarbones were not worth the lost meals she endured, and her thigh gap showed the gap in her brain where the common sense was once stored. This is not a poem, and I am not a poet. When I'm unable to find a better way of saying that in 2012, 48 people in Great Britain were killed by guns. So I stand shoulder to shoulder and arm in arm and hand in broken hand with a canal and a railway in their weeds. I am not a poet, but I can't find a more beautiful way to say that no nation in the world imprisons as many members of its population as America does. I'm sorry, not all black, it's beautiful. So give me 10 boxes of chalk and let me play hopscotch. A blanket and mattress, I'll make a castle and sit there on that watch. I said you wear gravity too much. We got up to leave, our crumpled napkin faces telling too much. I told her, I'll meet you on the moon. From that day, I abandoned any hope of metaphor and accepted that I could not write poetry about this. I hold my head bowed in public places, feeling so strongly the gaps and the spaces. And as the light found its way to the window panes of my bedroom, it found its way to me too. You? Yeah. Who write revolutionary symphonies from beneath your single bed? You who type masterpieces on back alley blackberries that will never be read. This is not a poem, and I am not a poet. Thank you very much.